trade routes from 600 AD through to 1750 by Cameron Hollander, Zach Scott, Angela Carr, C3. In 600 AD, the main source of trade and contact was the Silk Road, which went from Europe and Africa through India and the Middle East to China. Sea trade was focused on small ships traveling along coastlines over short distances. The Silk Roads were kept safe by the Mongols who ruled the area. After 1450, uh, wait, what? the new maritime technology such as, com such as the compass allowed prestigious explorers such as Columbus and Prince Henry the Navigator to find new trade routes making the Silk Road irrelevant. Christopher Columbus sailed across the Atlantic and discovered the Americas, opening up a new vast resource. Ha <laughs> ha. They brought livestock, disease, and other goods through the Columbian Exchange to America in return for gold and crops. At the end of this era, the Europeans started an age of imperialism using their new technology to dominate the world and claim certain parts for their own. China and Japan, however, were opposed to the new Westerners and closed themselves off to almost all trade and new ideas. Get out. The end.